Hey guys, today I'm finally filming a very requested video, which is the what's in my backpack. It's not a tag, just a video. You guys have been asking for this since about August and I keep saying I'm going to do it, but I can just never find the time to sit down and film it. I can't believe it's already November. I have exactly one month until finals start and it's crazy because at, on one hand, I feel like I've been in school for like a, a week like no time has gone by but then I think about it and I'm like wow I feel like I've been here for like a hundred years so it's really weird but I don't want time to speed up all my friends are like oh thank god like school's almost out I don't want time to speed up because for one every day that passes we're getting closer to finals so I'm just gonna start showing you what's in my bag it's super heavy so I can't really hold it up for too long but this is the Jan Sport Cool Student Tech Backpack. And I got it at Kohl's. I think it was originally like $75, but I think I got it for like 50 or something. So it's just the heather gray one with the brown bottom. And I tried to get a backpack that was like kind of cute because I have to carry it every day. And I didn't want something that I hated and that would like make me feel like even more stupid than I do with the backpack. Like nothing screams. 1L more than I think a huge backpack does but what can you do it like I need everything that I have with me so this backpack has a water bottle slot which is really helpful because I think like all 1Ls around the country have this Lexus water bottle and I use it every single day and I always have it with me so it's convenient to have it go right on the side and I don't have to worry about it like spilling all over my laptop. So we'll go through the main pocket first. This bag has like 5,000 pockets but the main huge one is in the back. It has a laptop slot so I have my MacBook back there and this case which you guys ask about a lot is just a pink case off of Amazon just like the generic Amazon ones so fits nicely in that slot then I have my binder and this is just a half inch binder and I have all of my um I have all of my syllabi in here separated out by which class it is and then I have some review sheets and like practice questions in each section and then I just have some cases I had to print out for my memo and um, I just keep like important papers that I don't want to leave at home when I go to class like I need my syllabi in every class to like flip to the cases and stuff like that but I don't print out my case briefs I know I used to do that at the beginning of the semester and I know a lot of people do that but I just found that it was way too much paper I had to switch binders and it was huge it was just a waste of paper and a waste of my time and energy and money to be printing them out because the corrections I make on my briefs, like I'd rather just type them. Next I have a book. I'm going to Crim Law right after I finish this video. So I have my Crim Law book. I rent all my books. This one is from Chegg. Saves you so much money. So that's the only book I have in here. But usually I would have two because I have two classes every day. So I only have one right now, which is so much better for my back than having two. I also have my planner. You guys ask about this planner all the time. This is from personalplanner.com. I'll have it linked below. It's just a website where you can customize planners like completely. So I just have a horizontal layout. It's an 18 month planner, it comes with a little ruler. It's perfect. I think I have a coupon code, so I'll have that link below too. This is a great planner. I love planners and this is just, I think a really good bargain if you really like the customized option of like, an Erin Condren or something like that, but you don't want like a huge agenda. I love Erin Condren, but the agenda is seriously the size of like a textbook. It's just not necessary. It's not. So the only other thing I have in this massive pocket is my makeup bag, which I just switched between my purse and my backpack. So it's the exact same stuff that's in my makeup bag that I just did a what's in my purse video on that'll be linked below. This is just an Ulta. It just has like a foundation powder and a million nude lipsticks that are all the same color. There's another pocket that's like just one size down. I don't have anything in here. Usually I would put my planner in there, but it ended up in the big pocket. Then it has this zip pocket, which is really tiny. And what I keep in here is just my pencil, a like pencil bag that I have post-its and pens and highlighters and I really don't use any of these pens. I use the exact same pen every day which is this one because it makes my handwriting look really nice. 
So I really don't even need this, but I guess it's just for like reassurance, but use the same pen every day. Next is a small litter pocket. This is where I keep my chargers and food. I have this little Tupperware thing, which I have almond butter in. I make breakfast at school pretty much every day and I have oatmeal, so that's in there. I have my laptop charger. I have my Tech Snake portable charger, which comes in handy all the time because my phone's always dead and it just fits really nicely. There's like a little side pocket in here and it just slides in there really nicely. I also have some headphones, which I'm not gonna take out because they're heavily tangled. And then I have, ew, a packet of oatmeal, which is my breakfast. And I have, oops, I had a hair clip, but I just dropped it and I'm not gonna pick it up. So that's all I have in that pocket. I would usually have my phone charger too, but my phone is charging currently. And then the last pocket is this little tiny pocket up front. And only thing I keep in there is my wallet. Nice, easy access for my ID or my card if I'm like buying something in the cafe. But that is everything that I keep in my backpack. I really don't keep a lot in there because the textbooks are heavy enough as is. And when you add more and more stuff, it's just like, you don't even want to carry it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I have to go to class now, so I'm going to end it here. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe if you aren't. And I will see you in my next video.